Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into a brand new contender in the smartphone world, the Librus Nex. It's a Linux-powered smartphone packed with some mind-blowing specs, and I'm here to give you all the juicy details. So, let's jump right in. The Liberu Nex is no ordinary smartphone. It's designed with two main goals in mind, security and longevity. Let's be honest, how many times have we seen perfectly good phones become useless due to planned obsolescence? Well, the Nexus developers want to change the game, making this device as future-proof as possible. Now, here's where it gets interesting. While most smartphones run Android, which is technically based on Linux, the Nex runs its own operating system called Liberux OS. It's built on Debian 13 and is all about giving you more control, privacy, and security. Oh, and it even has a desktop mode. You can wirelessly connect it to a monitor, keyboard, and mouse, basically turning your phone into a mini PC. How cool is that? All right, let's talk hardware. The Librux Nex isn't pulling any punches. It's powered by an RK3588S SoC, which might sound familiar if you've dabbled in single board computers. On top of that, it boasts a massive 32 gigabytes of LPDDR4X RAM. That's way more than most flagship phones on the market today. And if storage is your thing, you're covered with 256 gigabytes of built-in storage, plus the option to expand it using a micro SD card. Oh, and did I mention there's also an insane 2 terabyte storage option? Yeah, let that sink in for a second. The display is a 6.34-inch OLED panel with a resolution of 2400 by 1080, protected by Corning Gorilla Glass. It's sharp, durable, and even includes a fingerprint sensor. Perfect for media consumption and day-to-day -day tasks. For connectivity, you've got a Snapdragon X62 modem, enabling blazing fast 5G speeds. But here's a feature that really stands out. Dedicated kill switches. With a flick, you can disable the microphone, cameras, Wi-Fi, or Bluetooth. Talk about privacy on steroids. Another unique aspect of the Lebris Nex is its removable 5,300 milliamp hour battery. Yep, removable. When was the last time you saw a modern smartphone with that option? This means you can swap it out yourself, adding to its lifespan. As for cameras, the Nex comes equipped with a 32 megapixel main camera and a 13 megapixel front camera. While it's not trying to compete with high-end camera phones, these specs are solid enough for everyday photos and video calls. So, here's the catch. The Liberu Nex is being funded through a crowdfunding campaign. That means pricing details aren't available just yet, but if you're interested, it's definitely something to keep an eye on. And if you're looking for alternatives, brands like Purism also offer Linux phones, but those models are getting a bit outdated now. So, what do you think of the Liberux Nex? Is this the future of secure and sustainable smartphones, or just another niche product? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you don't miss out on more tech updates. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.